Our job isn't about us. We're here to guide others 24 7. It's all about remaining focused under pressure. I can't afford to have a pounding headache. So when pain is tough, I choose Panadol Extra Soluble, as it's up to 30% more powerful than standard paracetamol tablets. When tough pain is gone, life takes its place. Before you take the plunge into a new day, before the cogs start to turn, before you take the lead, or hit the ground running, give yourself the best possible start with a delicious, natural breakfast that's full of slow-release energy. Flavins. Energy for life. Listerine Advanced White can give you whiter teeth in two weeks. For an amazing smile that can get you noticed, making you feel bolder and more likely to charm your way out of a ticket. Or ask a stranger out on a date. For whiter teeth in two weeks, bring out the bold. And now add even more power to your bold smile. Choose one of three vibrant Barry M lipsticks with every limited edition bottle of Listerine Advanced White. Which one will you choose? At Boyle Sports, we're giving you the chance to clean up at Cheltenham. That's why we've just released our fastest ever app with more Cheltenham offers than ever before. Plus, don't forget the free-to-play Boyle Sports Fantasy Racing Game, where you could win VIP trips to both the Irish and Aintree Grand Nationals, plus dozens of runner-up prizes. So why not text RACING to 53603 or visit boylesports.com slash fantasy to play for free now. Bring it on! When you drive Tipo's wheels and they give you the feels, that's a more. When the traffic is glum, turn the DA beyond, that's a more. Trips away, Tipo's great for play, so they say don't delay the boot Stella. So for those in the know, say hello to Tipo, that's a more. <sighs> Wake up, snooze, get up, suit up, breakfast, teeth, traffic, work, final boss, lunch, dream about new job, work, traffic, click, 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 TV, early night. Ever wanted to break away from the norm and start your own business? Take the first step. Register your own unique website name with register365.com today. Wake up, jump up, throw on pros. Ah, we're here. We've made it. Break free with register365. It all starts with a dot com. Oh, delicious. Will Ireland beat England tomorrow? By a cricket score. The Gold Cup never fails to deliver. We've had another epic race, which has ended in victory for Sizing John. Robbie Power on the right, Ellen Potts on the left, and Jessie Harrington, what a story. She is now, after a 10th Cheltenham Festival win, the most successful female trainer in Cheltenham history. We'll hopefully speak to Jessie very soon. Lovely scenes in the winner's enclosure. The contrast, and before, before we see this, Colin Tizard, we've spoken to Colin Tizard, Q card is absolutely fine, he says. He's told us that, which is great news. How was Q card travelling throughout? It's hard to gauge, really, because when you see him and we, when we look at it here, Paddy's giving him a little squeeze. Now, just watch what happens. In the nose, a jockey, Just watch how low he crowds a squeeze, squeeze. And he's just... He'd done it's a almost like he did the very same thing as he, last year, chap. an identical fall to last year, pretty much, you know? Whether he's just taken his eye off it and followed Bristol and, the Mayan front. Whether, him, whether, whether he didn't see much of the yeah. from Bristol the Mayan front, who knows? It's difficult to tell from that angle, but it was a difficult fall. It was a heavy fall. Luckily, great for the horse that he's okay. That yeah, is great news, it. exactly. Q card is fine. This is repeat what Colin Tizard has told us. Right, key moment in the race, mate. <sighs> Look at this. You're racing down to it here. You, you know, Ruby hasn't gone for everything at this stage. Squeeze, squeeze, puts down on him, lets him down. Then the horse comes in. Look at Ru Ruby. He's like a rodeo rider trying to maintain the part. 
partnership. I just thought he raced a little bit too much in his hands for a Gold Cup. You need them to be relaxed. And I just thought that Jack Adam was doing a little bit too much. And this is the part of the oh. Gold Cup. You need to really, really stay in. Size and John, really, but, really but look at that. Watch Robbie Power down to the last. Slap, slap, come on. Come for me, stride. And the stride comes from him. And his heart picks up. And now he knows. Come on, I need you. And look who's coming into the picture now, AP. Here comes Manella Rocco. Yeah, the two of them, both, both Nathan, Nathan River and Manella Rocco. There wasn't much between them in the four-miler last year. There's not much between them again. Unfortunately for Manella Rocco, he had one in front of him. Oh, for Paul Lizzie Kelly. Two fences the dream lasted. You can see the frustration. It's impossible not to feel for it. Oh, it is. I don't care who you are. You know, when you don't feel like you get a run for your money. Once a year, once a year, oh. chance at a Gold Cup. You have to say it. That Sizing John was a good winner, though. Oh, he was. Stepping up and trip, becoming the third horse to win the Irish Gold Cup and the Cheltenham Gold Cup in the same year after Jodami and Imperial Call. And they think he was on over two mile last year. Cheltenham was second to do, man. Let's pause there for a second. It's time for the presentation for the Gold Cup. Let's hand you over to Ollie Bell. Ladies and gentlemen, time now for the presentation of the 2017 Tomiko Gold Cup. And what a performance from a horse bred in England and trained in Ireland by Sizing John. Here to make the presentation is Tim Radford, Tomiko CEO, accompanied by Her Royal Highness Princess Royal. And first up to receive the prize for the winning owner, it is a first gold cup. Ladies and gentlemen, put your hands together for the Anne and Alan Potts partnership. performance this was from the Queen of Cheltenham ladies and gentlemen your winning trainer is Jesse Harrington Today, he is a Gold Cup winning jockey, his second winner of the week. Ladies and gentlemen, let's hear it for Robbie Power. most important cog of the wheel, the lady that spends every day by this horse's side. It is the winning groom, Ashley Hussey. What a horse race, ladies and gentlemen. One final time, let's hear it for your winner of the 2017 Tomiko Gold Cup, Sizing John. I don't know about you guys, I just love seeing Jesse Harrington up there. And the name of this horse is great, because the fact is Johnny Harrington would have, he'd have loved today, wouldn't he? Johnny is looking down from somewhere, and he's very proud. He really is, because he loved Cheltenham, like all of us do. But this is a very proud day for them. It wasn't a bad decision from Mrs. J. Harrington, stepping the horse up in trip. Got yeah. sick of the sight of Duva. <laughs> that race in Perlis and the Kinlock Bray, always a race that stands up to the toast of scrutiny where this horse beat sub-lieutenant who was second, of course, earlier on in the week as well. Rock solid form and he went on to win the Irish Gold Cup. 
and that is a special moment. Robert Power and Jessica Harrington embrace after winning the greatest jump race of them all, the blue ribbon of chasing. Yeah, fantastic. Like he won the first time Robbie Power rode him was at Christmas, two miles against Duvan, and then as you say went to two and a half miles at Thurlis and who would have thought he'd won a gold cup? Photographers there it just shows the interest and the buzz around the place now and the crowd. And but this is it, honestly. The cup, this is never it. lets you down, does it? This ever. is the race, the race as purists of this sport that you want to win. And Tim Radford from Tomiko, he's owned a lot of very good horses in his, himself in the past. The likes of Raymond, Racing Damon, Calgary Bay, you know, he. He'd have loved to have won the Gold Cup, but never mind sponsor the race. So the stories to come out of the race, we talked about cue card, it still eludes. After this week, it's about the only race that eludes Willie Mullins. It remains the holy grail for him. Well, the only thing we can say to him is the fellow was placed three times before winning. So he still shouldn't give up <laughs> with Jack Gannon. <laughs> well, you think, you think staying's the problem, don't you, with... Yeah, look, I, he, he, I think you know he won over two and a half mile at Punchestown. He was a little disappointed at Christmas then behind Outlander, but I'm not so sure he's got enough stamina to win a Gold Cup. That's the Gold Cup is the last sort of furlong, furlong half of the Gold Cup is all about stamina. And you see the race change so much from coming down the hill to turning into the straight in the Chapman Gold Cup. Who knows yet? Next year for Willie Mullins, will it be Jack and Am? It might be your kill. We shall see. Here Jesse Harrington, Harrington. <laughs> the heroine, oh. the queen of Cheltenham is joining us.